Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalatu wassalamu ala rasulillah. Rabbi şirah li sadri ve yassiri li emri ve ahlul uqdatan min lisani yafqahu qali. Hello brothers, this is how are you? Uh, in today's lesson, uh, there's a difference lesson between uh, this lesson and the previous lesson. Uh, in this lesson, I would like to uh, share with you uh, a very small and big program. Really, I uh, uh, just downloaded this, this program and I learned some some of uh, tips and tricks uh, in that program, and it's it's a really cool program. So uh, it's all about street structure, and uh, this is the parable uh, modeling. So as you see, you guys, uh, this is a free program. I have a 30 day uh, uh, free for this program. And as you see, there's a very kind uh, or many things inside this program, and we we, we can work with. As you see here, uh, we have uh, profiles, we have build-up sections, we have call forms, L section, host section, channels, whatever we want. And also, we can if we have autograph file, we can we can ch uh, ch uh, convert it to uh, grid lines. It's it's very cool. Uh, this thing is not exist in advanced steel. I, I, I'm working in advanced steel, uh, as you see, guys. But if I change uh, this one to, I don't know if I change it to to do uh, AutoCAD, it will remain or not. But I'll try. Yeah, as you see now, uh, I'm just like uh, working AutoCAD. So as you see, uh, I don't have any kind of uh, advanced steel uh, elements here, but uh, para build. Uh, modeling I have here so for the guys who, who work in, uh, with AutoCAD and uh, they don't want to uh, install uh, advanced steel they can use this uh, call program which is para building uh, build modeling he has as, as I said uh, <coughs> I'm sorry uh, as I said we when we have uh, some AutoCAD lines what we can do we can just go to uh, convert lines to grids as you see here, you just select the objects, uh, enter the name of the grid. Let's say this is the one. Uh, just by one click, it changed this one. Again, this one. Let's say two. So whatever we want, so we can uh, convert it to grid lines. So that's very very cool. And here we can modify levels. What uh, what levels we have, we can add as you see to the world. Uh, I can add another another one. Uh, let's say uh, six meter, uh, six meter uh, high. Okay, and I can say another one. Let's say seven point five meter. If we have a warehouse, so I can just click okay. So when I have uh, 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 these levels, so it's it's, it's kind of. Uh, levels okay uh, so I can arrange with this one it's not not about this one also I also have here what I have I have floors so and some kind of uh, fiberglass uh, floor grating or uh, pattern like grating or lock um, bar or welded bar uh, which let's say to with two points as you see if I change this one to uh, to uh, conceptual you see that this kind of the welded bar is not exist in it exists in tech lab but it's not exists exist in advanced steel so when we want to uh, make this one in advanced steel it takes a lot of time okay so another thing we have what we have we have custom sh shapes we have others uh, so we can we have concrete walls we have con corrugated web corrugated web as is here corrugated web is one of the of the of the kind of uh, beam if we go uh, like this and just click OK we see that this is the corrugated web you see guys corrugated web this one maybe this one we are using this so uh, the corrugated web so it's uh, another cool uh, thing uh, and also from the profiles what we have we can modify the axis of the profile we can correct twist it uh, we can lowering uh, a member there are many things that we can do doing guys uh, it's, it's really really uh, pretty uh, good program 
and it's not only this one uh, let me try this one also we can use uh, this one arc so uh, we can use arcs uh, just like this you see we can use advanced or uh, if we want we can choose the others so what what kind of, of arc we want for example this one as you see and close it after that we can use this one for example from 200 let's say 1000 and this is the degree of, of that one it's 90 degree let's say we have one um, 270 just like this just click here so it gives and gives us and just close it and not only this even we have a place with polygon polygon so we can uh, put, um, uh, use a rectangle place okay so what we have to do we have this uh, let me see uh, this or the UCS I want to just close this one as here we have uh, this is the plate with bolt and we can uh, from place we can chaffer it uh, we can convert strips to plate we can do many many things guys okay and this is the 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 pl uh, plate modify plate vertices uh, we have many many things in element library if we want uh, for example bring uh, something from library we can just do it by clicking and bringing this this one you see for example we have something like uh, something like this uh, and we have this one and we have also here uh, balls we can draw balls we can draw a uh, bolt on plane we can do many many things we can have to select plane okay if we have uh, some some beams let's say if we have uh, we can use what kind of uh, HEA and what kind of sections that we have let's say we have uh, HEA uh, 300 and I'll choose uh, two points so uh, working with two points I'll close this one and uh, if we select this one select the plane this point to that point enter it into this one uh, okay. uh, anyhow so we can use uh, for example balls also for this we can specify if uh, there's some washers washer number one washer number two if we want uh, as you see we can use whatever we want a uh, whole tolerance the diameter is let's say uh, 20 uh, penetration length is 50 bolt in workshop if it's for in workshop it's not in on site uh, so we can do it just like uh, simply uh, in welding in shop and 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 on site so just click ok and after that I can click whatever I want okay so uh, that's very good and we have uh, another thing cut entire against another element if we want to have another element so we want to cut uh, we can do it we have direct bolt automatic bolts to for the teaching surfaces for example if we have another uh, c-shape for example let's say upm 100 with two points and i will choose this point to that point okay and i will use this point uh, this one to the under uh, this is the badge uh, justification if i select this one i'll select this point and this one and this one and also enter you see guys it uh, automatically gives me uh, a bolts you see it gives me bolts and I can arrange the bolts the distances uh, whatever I want this five number so I don't want five to be let's say to be only two okay and I will after that I will arrange the distances uh, the distances let's say this is uh, 20 and um, this is 20 let's say you see and now it goes with uh, in, uh, the middle and uh, as you hear the macros in the group the macros in the group here is uh, when uh, we have some uh, some 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 
uh, joints. I'll, I'll come, come back the, uh, this one to this one later uh, in detail. But when we have uh, uh, some joints, we want to uh, copy all or let's say modify all the joints. We can use uh, from here all or bolt in pattern because it's, uh, if we have another uh, bolt in teaching surfaces, it will not uh, affect on that one also. However, uh, we can go uh, advance, uh, advance it and we can use uh, from the here, we, we can change the uh, orientation, we can bolt in workshop, we can delete this one, hold tolerances, penetration lengths, we can use or we can uh, modify all of this. I can uh, say washers from here and here and I'll close this one and now I have washer here so um, there are many many cool things about that okay so how about uh, uh, we talked about uh, about this one uh, a lot but how about if uh, I want to make a warehouse a, a whole warehouse how, how it takes or how, how long it takes okay uh, of course we have connections here we have many connections here uh, it has a very good connection a uh, connection library uh, so we will uh, come to that later but how about if I want to uh, model a, a, a frames okay portal frames so I'll click just click here and you see guys there are many things we have platforms we have staircases we have buildings just like this we have building connections let's try to use this one and I will say okay my god you see guys everything everything thing is ex exist so how can I modify this one you see the, the, the joints the things everything is, is, is ready for me and I'll just uh, have to right click okay and I get everything but I don't want to with these uh, dimensions and this height so how can I solve this one I can just double click from here and well, I found the, the biggest one okay so what I say uh, I say that the, 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 the number of the span I have let's say I have uh, seven okay and the total distance yeah it, it, it will change this one okay and this distance I have I have uh, for example six thousand and uh, the total distance uh, I'll, I'll come to that that one also uh, okay and the span what I have I have uh, let's say 20,000 and about the length okay everything's changed in with this position and about the length uh, we have let's say uh, I don't know maybe 6,000 it's just like this you see now is everything is good uh, in, in spite of this this point and this point is, is is lower so I'll just close this one I have no problem with that one and another cool thing uh, what I want I want to just double click here and from here as I said that I will come to that point uh, macros in group uh, I'll say I'll, I'll say building three. This is the building three. When when I change this one, this is here. This is three and five. I'll I'll make it seven uh, seven thousand five hundred. If I change this one, it's it will change only building three. If I say set all, and I change it, let's say to seven five hundred, and I click here. And groups. Uh, if you just go back a little bit, I think I have to uh, choose it from the first. I'm sorry about that because I'm, I'm uh, just download this one, so I, I knew from here. If you want, you can just uh, go to the. Uh, I'll say uh, here. Uh, let's say propagate, and uh, let's say this seven hundred five thousand. And I think I have to change all or not. I don't know. Or uh, propagate value. Yeah, propagate value from the propagate value. So I have to propagate value. So 
it will change everything here we have uh, IPE for the, the IP 300 like I, we can say IP 270 just as you said uh, as you use so that IPE 240 and this IP 300 let's say if uh, this one IP 200 uh, anyhow so we can just uh, close this one of course what we can do we can just uh, select uh, this connection and right uh, just uh, show in micro and enter uh, for the building uh, what I want I want to change how can I change the yeah I can change uh, connection by double clicking here and uh, now I can change whatever in, the, in this connection that I want for example this one I want to be uh, 15 uh, millimeter uh, I will say a group uh, for the group I will say all and I will say propagate values and sometimes it takes some time and let me uh, change the column in or reinforcement uh, from the reinforcement let's say what we have we have this one let is let us say 1000 okay so let's say propagate value is this here I think everything is changed uh, from now and just exit yeah everything changed yeah that's very good that's a very cool thing cool thing and beam stiffener we can uh, use uh, or change the, this beam stiffener we can use whatever we uh, we want and after that this is the the the, uh, the connections for this beam we can change set the the plates we can set everything with well, that we want uh, if if we consider that if we consider that uh, guys we uh, we consider that we don't have uh, this one okay if I delete this one and this one of course I have to delete these elements oh, sorry these elements and automatic clutch control uh, so what I want to uh, show you I want to show you if we have uh, if we want to pay, put a, a turnbuckle so we can use this one bracing uh, we have many things we got two angles uh, angles already we have this one this one this one whatever we want you see but I want to use this one round uh, rules so just by clicking here and you can select me okay uh, fix the top and uh, we want to the to the axis of the line or whatever we want uh, I think uh, this is the first uh, the best one so I'll say okay and I will use this one use this one and by just by clicking this it, it will make for me and if this is about the connection uh, it gives me the, this kind of this type of connection so I'll say okay just right click after that okay I can use whatever <coughs> I'm sorry I can use whatever I want for example where you want to road 25 millimeter it will change to 25 millimeter it's it's a very cool thing and maybe uh, when we we model something like this in advanced steel, here of course we can use from uh, 500 to uh, let's say 800 again this one 800 and if we say propagate value you see you see that uh, now works for us and of course we can you can choose this one we can use these many things term back if we want to change this this kind of term back on this is the five uh, 90 degree and uh, 19 and just we can say close this one and close this one not only this and after after we finish the uh, all the uh, things what we can do we can just select one right click uh, and uh, what we can do um, we can uh, of course we, we can 
or let me first of all let me draw the the the, the parents so from here and uh, draw grating or uh, from this one cladding draw cladding first draw cladding what we have we have apex or wall uh, for example i want to uh, draw apex so uh, the the, the uh, roof cladding just click ok I will uh, we, I can use whatever section I want for example channels parents here so we have uh, this parent we can use whatever sections you want if we, you want you can use a hollow section uh, 8 for 3 millimeter for example ok and I will say ok and I will use this one these sections after I finish I will say enter again for the other side, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Enter. As you see here, now, <coughs> I'm sorry. We, uh, we will wait a little, a uh, little. After that, we get all the uh, dimensions, all the things here. As you see, I'll just click and click exist. You see, we have uh, this one. The number is uh, we have uh, six numbers. I can use this one, for example, the distance between this and that. Uh, this is the section. This is the first one. You see, everything is good. And this is the parents. If I have, I want to uh, uh, overhatch from this point here. And now I have two, uh, twenty. A centimeter is two uh, two hundred uh, millimeter. I'll, I'll say okay. And there are many things. If I say uh, the macros, enter. Uh, what I can do if I want to change the the, the I take it to up, and I'll just I can just click here, and I will use this point. You see, now oh, it's very good. Uh, look, guys, when it 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 uh, changes the the <laughs> the, <laughs> the color. I think it, it means that there's a clashing but when I change uh, change back to this one uh, where is that that one uh, got click here I think it has some some problem sometimes uh, I'll just go back a little bit and I will say UV in macro enter and I will go with this one I'll click from this point and close now it uh, color changed to that one uh, by the way because it's, it's only one you see because it's only one just so it uh, only fixed that one so I will say UV in macro enter uh, from here and I will use this one also close I think I have to use one by one or maybe there's another way to to do this Anyhow, so uh, select the uh, the selection point is under, uh, so we can select the section point by selecting this one. Close. So anyhow, I can close this one, so we can uh, make for the uh, the rest. Okay, if we delete this connection, what will happen? And as here now, it's like this. So. Uh, another another type of of, of uh, the building we can use what we can use we can use this one or this one maybe this one okay uh, building with no connection building with this one and as you hear the insertion point is, is in this uh, the same place so uh, what I want to do I'll just close this one and move this one or delete this one Uh, let's see this one and uh, this one uh, right click okay 
uh, as we said for the biggest one double click we will set all of these <coughs> I'm sorry all of these dimensions for all 6,000 and this 20,000 and this is one two three propagate and just I want to just close this one uh, I want to mm, make this one only six spans and after that double click on this one I want to make all and I will just have to say this one is just like this and of course I will use uh, IPE from here IP 300 let's say and this one again let's say others IPE uh, 300 or maybe uh, not from here from here this time because I use the, the profile close and this one also uh, 270 and propagate values you see when I propagate values so for the the rest it will change okay just close it and how I can how can I uh, insert connection uh, before I learned how can I uh, insert this one but how can I insert connection I think there's a difference between these these two sections so the uh, uh, for the biggest one double click uh, or maybe uh, for the smaller one oh yeah of course this one uh, what we have here we have this uh, one and if we say this one we have 200 yeah, of course I have to choose from here uh, at a section which is to IPE 270 70 mm, and I will close this one and propagate values and yeah now I think is is, is is good okay after that I will close this one so uh, for about the the, the uh, inserting inserting connections uh, what we need we need look for a base plate it should be uh, this is on the top okay so we will uh, draw in XY plane and after that I have to I have this connection which is hatch connection after I select this one I will uh, choose the column and after that I will close the the beam so I will use one uh, of these hatch uh, types uh, maybe this hatch uh, with profile this with place this prestige I think uh, this one is good for us so double click and r uh, right click this one after right clicking uh, what I need and for example this is 15 millimeters okay and uh, this is let's say uh, instead of t this number let's say 300 okay so this is the dim distance and this is the gavel this is the reinforcement and we need uh, this one to be 1000 millimeters so it's one meter and this just like this this is the the, the cops beam stiffener if we want yeah we have these two column stiffener after that after that uh, we have bolts so for bolts uh, what we need we can uh, set the first distance which is 40 and uh, the the bottom one let's say also 40 or maybe 60 bottom one if it's good uh, that's good otherwise we have to change the the, the 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 number of the bolts let's say five if we say five we see what will happen and it will make like this so I want to put three on top uh, I'll click here uh, by this way I'll say 40 uh, after 40 I have uh, or uh, look there's four distances one two three four this is the f uh, four distances uh, the, uh, let's say the first one 80 the second one 80 and the third one 120 and this one 80 uh, let's say 20 
let's say no uh, I'll, I'll leave it uh, this one as uh, uh, flexible because why why flexible because I I use I uh, used the also I'll, I'll tell you that of, of course I can't uh, use these shapes but why why when I change this one uh, it should be this one flexible why because I just I close it I put this one 60 if I put 100 it will go up just like this okay so I'll close this one and or maybe before I close I'll double click here for the connection what I want I want to propagate values and I see uh, and nothing will happen why so I have to copy because I don't have a uh, copy this this one so I'll click here I will say uh, I want to be a smart copy uh, for example smart copy for this one click on the column and beam column beam column beam column beam again for the other side column beam column and after that beam column after that beam column after that beam so guys as you see here after the right click uh, as you see as you, oh, of course uh, after that I'll go with the bolts bolt diameter maybe uh, 20 is good just close it uh, before you, uh, I close what I can do I can just uh, so as to be sure that uh, copy for all uh, I will go with the bolts 20 I can say propagate va uh, values okay so I I, I ensure that uh, the, all of it uh, or I can just open two or three you see now bolts are 20 and the, this the 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 the, the bolt uh, standard okay as I can close it that is really good uh, of course uh, for apex I, I can do for this for apex again uh, this apex click and click uh, what I want I want to apex hunch for example this one apex hunch and also okay and I also right click uh, I will say maybe this one also 15 and reinforcement and this one 1000 at each side and stiffener we have these stiffeners the thickness is 12 I can change to 10 okay the balls also I can change it to 20 mm, by the same way we can use uh, for example let's say 40 oh my god this 40 this one and this one 40 so we fix these two the upper and bottom one and after that we will play with this uh, by clicking from here we can uh, cl uh, click okay and just propagate values or uh, before propagate values because we didn't have this one so I have what have we have to do we have to go to with the smart copy uh, these to that go back to the connection and smart copy from this to that this to that this to that these to that and these to that just right click and close it uh, as you see how how is is uh, fast is this one and if, after that uh, for the draw cladding click here uh, let's say for the uh, wall first okay okay I'll say okay select the columns just like this after that enter and choose the direction so the direction uh, I want to be uh, to this direction and we see if it works for uh, for uh, work for us you see now yeah it works for us and <coughs> this is the Perlin one <coughs> <coughs> I'm sorry I can use whatever I want number of Perlins <coughs> the distances and uh, 
just let me try to explain what number is five. <coughs> the distance between, if it's not not, uh, so I'll say okay. Uh, it's the distance between between is one hundred. So how can I change this one? I'll see. Is here uh, this for that one, and for the number of pair lengths we have uh, the as you see the total length m uh, number or variable the total uh, let's say various uh, start of set and entire length uh, and let's say this one also. Uh, this number as you see the distance between is, uh, is 1000 I'll, I'll say 1000 not 100 just like this okay you see now everything is good maybe I change it to six number yeah I think it's good now if I change it here I can click to that side so there's no clash at all okay maybe this one's seven so I could get the maximum point and the permanent two I don't want to be any kind of uh, overhanging so I'll change to this one to that okay so just click okay now uh, we have uh, this one uh, for the for the apex, what I do, I I, I will I will choose another uh, section, so it gives me also connection with that one. How? Uh, go the cladding, draw and the apex. Okay. So for the apex, what I am going to use, I am going to use uh, C shape, let's say, or uh, a cold form shape in the shape of um, Z. Okay. I'll say that uh, Z180, uh, so OK. I'll say OK. Select the uh, frames or rafters. Enter. Select the other side. Enter. You see, now asks me, it asks me about the connection. So I want to this kind of connection. OK. For the other side, of course, I want to the same connection. OK. And now we see that uh, we have uh, parallels with the connections. After a while, it takes a while because it uh, gives us these all these connections. As you see, now everything is good. <coughs> the number and the uh, this one is everything is good. Uh, instead, uh, instead of this, uh, this one, Z should be here. So how we can solve this problem? It's pretty easy. Just by clicking here and clicking this point. Yeah. Now it's very good. And what we can do just uh, we can just close it and close uh, this one. Uh, if we ch want to change the the dimension of the of the balls. You see here we have a uh, dimension of plate and bolts. You can just double click here and uh, we can choose whatever we want here. Uh, as you see here, bolts and uh, this one. Uh, by clicking this one, I can, I can say this one 40 by 40. Or uh, or what, what I can do, I can just, by clicking here, I can set this dimension. You see? I can say this dimension. It's, it's uh, both of them are applicable for the stiffener. Uh, what I want, as is here, is 186. Uh, uh, so I can just click here, and I can change this from 120 if I want. You see, uh, for this one, uh, it's uh, L shape because it's L shape. I can just change another think for another one maybe uh, this one applicable for me yeah it's very good so I don't say that uh, 
clip angle with stiffener I'll say okay and I'll say uh, propagate uh, values so I will see what will happen as you see the rest is solved also the rest is solved also now it's very good and I think uh, everything is okay and uh, we can use for uh, the side we can use a base plate also after that what I'm going to do I'm going to just select this one right click and uh, uh, yeah we can go with the uh, sheet manager or, or uh, let's uh, before uh, everything uh, what we can do we can we have from tools switch to uh, what we can do we can uh, of course we can um, export this one and we can perform numbering revisions uh, store current as you see uh, store current number in uh, number in the paper this one we can just say close it and we have uh, clarify there are many things so we can do just right by right clicking uh, we can get nothing <coughs> so after that we can go with uh, there are many many other things we can export this one the cool thing about uh, behind that I want to uh, say this one we have numbering revisions we have many things we can exercise we have exercises we, if we want to uh, put uh, this the help file we can use start uh, but not this one and uh, what I want, I want to go to rebuild uh, bill of material. We have a cool thing about bill of, bill of material, and continue without locking. We can say uh, because it's it's uh, it's uh, uh, the free version. So we can go to build uh, bill uh, se uh, selection. What we want from this one, we don't need what need and washers cutting a uh, list with image we want to this one uh, simply we don't need this one bolts a uh, simply position list and uh, we can position of the plates <coughs> list of ordering what we want we can choose from here and uh, the rounding with this one so uh, we can say okay and it gives us all the uh, require things you see guys it's it's pretty good uh, job it converts to Excel and everything uh, I don't want to save this one you see I IPE and with the position with the number with the length with the weight with the <coughs> paint stuff and <laughs> total weight <coughs> I'm sorry and not only this uh, as is here also this assembly a1 a2 a3 uh, b1 which has uh, all this one b2 b3 uh, just like uh, this not only this this one we have with pictures the the, the 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 degree of cutting the distances we have many things we have rhs L, uh, z sections this is for perlins again uh, not only these what we uh, we can also we can do we can just go to draw section uh, I think draw section no uh, yeah uh, profile length optimization this profile uh, length optimization uh, we can continue without uh, locking position number and let's say okay and let's say okay we have these parts uh, and we can say okay 
this now uh, tells us which uh, part we have to buy which part we have uh, on our store uh, there's no stock so uh, we have to buy this kind of uh, materials if we have stock it's inside of stock it will use that one so as is here to buy to buy to buy so, so uh, this one uh, one should mm, uh, we should buy it's, it's very very good uh, program as you see here we have IP 270 we have to uh, buy uh, 84 uh, uh, or 48 48 okay so we have to buy 48 is it right or not we can we can just uh, select this Uh, for the setting here uh, after that what we can do uh, of course we can clash controls structure types we can do this one I don't want to uh, this after that I go I will go with the uh, export as I said uh, brother sisters um, just download this this one but you can uh, search for it and you get more information about that uh, after that I can export it to uh, IFC file or whatever you want let's say uh, browse I'll use a desktop new folder I'll say export just save it and OK and now what I'm going to do I'm going to just close this one I'll say no I will go back to my advanced steel. Of course, I will open this one in advanced steel. However, I didn't show you uh, how you can make uh, drawings there also. Anyhow, uh, I can go to import IFC file. I will use this one, application advanced steel. Okay. And I will use uh, this one. I, as you see here, IP 270. I want to be, uh, of course, I want to be I, I, uh, I sections. I want to be this kind of section IP E 270. So I want to, what's that one? IP E D 270. So it will, uh, it will be the same thing. Okay. I'll say okay. And if there's another thing, RHS 800 uh, for this one, I will change it to with the rectangular hollow section. Maybe this one or for the rectangular one. I can use whatever I have if it's not I will go to uh, bring another one for example Atlas and I will use this one 80 40 this one yeah so it's the same section I'll say okay for this L 50 by 50 by 5 so I what I can do I can go to the L shape angle and uh, maybe this one I don't know if we have 50 by 50 by 5 so this one I always use this one okay so it's just uh, about the, the, the converting uh, the profiles uh, this one uh, we have Z uh, but this Z should be uh, in, in the manner of that there's it's not uh, smaller than 180 because uh, we uh, after that we have problem with uh, with the connection okay also Z I don't know if Z one this one works or not okay anyhow I'll say okay for this C split angle let's see the same thing 
I know uh, this will be a problem, but anyhow, I don't want to choose this one. And after that, we'll see everything is, is uh, imported into inside advanced steel. And now why we, we, we uh, brought inside advanced steel? Uh, for the, as we know, uh, <coughs> after making uh, our conceptual, we don't need this one because this is my, I think, in my previous project. Anyhow, now you see everything is good with its uh, connection, but as you see, uh, this, uh, the, this angle because uh, there's uh, some problem with this angle, but at last, it's, it's good. Uh, when we can use uh, a suitable section because yeah, this is for, for the, uh, the uh, section that I uh, said I ignored this one I have to use another thing maybe uh, L section but anyhow as you see this is an I beam and this is blades you see we can go to the properties place 20, uh, 12 millimeters and after that we can uh, use uh, the well, what we can do we can use the uh, drawings and make drawings for this structure however inside 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 uh, parable uh, we can make connections of course we have trusses trusses between hatches many things many uh, here here is the cage ladder we have some types of it uh, we have a uh, spiral stair we have this one copy and uh, ro three rotation that's another cool thing uh, of course uh, we have for uh, floors we what we can do we can use uh, sandwich panels or we can whatever we want we can use uh, we have also built up sections as you see uh, sorry we go with the built up sections and we see two points if we have built up sections we can uh, use built up sections as you see here uh, Anyhow, so uh, there are many things uh, remain in this uh, uh, program, but I think uh, it's just a, a start of the, the program. Uh, so we have many, many things. Uh, you can get many uh, things from this program if you want. Thank you.